Okay, so I ran that uh, repair exe file and then uh, tried to log into WoW and Blizzard had, had a new 2.08 update today, so I don't know if that's what's fixed it or the repair thing fixed it, but it's fixed. And I was going to play the characters in the order in which I was I received them, but uh, KMG0 sent me uh, 60 Rogue who has Bloodfang gear and he has rank 14 longsword. I don't know if he has the other weapons or if he didn't have enough gold to buy them or I haven't checked his bank yet, but... So this is uh, KMG Zero's rogue. His name is Villain, and uh, let's get right to it. Okay, today we're going to explore Outworld land. Out, Outland. Yes, Outworld. I think was from Mortal Kombat. And this is the big bird. I haven't seen these before. They got armor on them. Armored griffins. There's all these moons and planets and stuff spinning around in the uh, sky. And apparently rocks can float. Check this out. Floating rocks everywhere. So I'm on this piece of land that's just floating, and later I find out that there's nothing underneath us. We're on like some kind of big space vacuum or something. So here's where uh, I'm trying to repair my gear that I messed up. This is actually after I've already done all this stuff. So okay, here's his rope. Here's his gear. I've got it zoomed in where you can check out all his uh, brutality blade, his uh, knight's champion, whatever. Long sword of doom. He's got all this blood fang gear, so I'm pretty pimp. Compared to Beto's level 40 rogue, this is like the old Nintendo slogan. Now you're playing with power. So I see this group of trolls and stuff. And I thought it was just like a regular bunch of groups, but then look at all these little buff things they got on top of their heads. There's some kind of enemy faction leaders or something. So apparently they're snap kicking me and they're doing mortal strikes because I checked the combat log and they just kicked my ass. I don't know who that was, but. Now we're going to do some warming up. This is my little rogue train. Oh, I love this Arathor tabard that he's got. I always wanted this on my palette because it's yellow and really would have went good with my tanks gear. Now this is one thing Blizzard does. You see this level 61 or whatever? 60? It's really huge, but at the same time it's really very weak. They make stuff that's really big, but it's really just pretty shitty. It's got a little heal spell. It's got two big swords that she hardly ever uses. And this is a sword spec rogue, and I really take advantage of sword spec because you get this repose skill, which you can disarm things with for a short amount of time. You can get rid of their main hand weapon. Let me turn my volume down here. I'm using blade flurry on this because if you get repost and you get blade flurry, you can attack targets that are adjacent to you at the same time you're killing your main target. So you see his pet die there? I didn't even attack his pet. It's just getting hit from the extra blade flurry attacks. And I'm slicing him, I'm stunning him, and then once he starts to attack me again, I'll disarm him with a repost. Which I don't think I did here, but that's my main strategy. Keep them stun locked, and then when they are fighting you, keep them unarmed. That way you're taking very little damage. Either they're hitting you with their bare fists, or they're just stunned and they can't hit you at all. That's what's great about being a rogue. You practically stun lock and disarm things. Now this here is some kind of big ripsaw monster or something somebody had already killed. I just wandered upon it and I wanted to check it out. Looks like one of those big next Ramus mobs I never got around to fighting because I unsubscribed before I got to it. This is your typical demon legionnaire that I've fought these before in the non burning crusade. This one's a little more pimp. Again, demons for some reason demons are really, really weak. They have no life, you can just pretty much smash the shit out of them. I was having some trouble with some hell boars earlier, some demon pigs. I don't know why, but they're chomping at me pretty bad. Uh, stamina scroll, might as well use that. I noticed there's a new type of cloth, like some kind of nether guard cloth or nether something. I don't know if you can make new bandages with it, but uh, that's something cool. And that thing there, I think that was one of the cloths. Or one of the, I found something. I don't know what it did, but it's one of these bosses drops it. But these aren't really bosses, they're just really big. I really like fighting big stuff. If you know anything about me, I like to just find the biggest things and attack it. And since I'm making a video here, I'm kind of lazy. Like, this is where I made a mistake. I didn't, normally you would clear out all these small things before you attack the big thing. But I just really wanted to make the video, so I just attack it in broad daylight with everything I'm watching. <laughs> As you can see, these little drainy guys come after me, or drani, however you pronounce it. 
I got one of those sister things attacking me. So I had to use the old vanishing powder. Now these things have saw blades which they can shoot at you like a range attack. I think they can only shoot them once because they only got that one saw blade. Looks really cool. I'll show you that in a second. As you can see, I kidney shot at the fuck out of it. He's stun locked. Now this sister over here is hitting me. I think I've got blade flurry gone. Yeah, that's what. They're doing too much damage. I finally got the thing down, but they're going to be too much for me. And there comes a fireball from the back. Now watch this one. I think this one shoots a saw blade at me. If I remember correctly. One of these does. I go on a saw blading rampage here. This uh, Grand Marshal Longsword is kicking pretty good ass. It's got Crusader in chance. When that procs you can do like a hell of a lot more damage. Yeah, that's that thing that I found. I don't know what it does. Okay, here's another one coming. I'm just going to go right into it. That's the thing about rogues, that they level up fast. You don't have to stop and bandage a whole lot. You can just keep going. Kill several things at once. I do get in situations where I'm low health, and I'm thinking, well, I can just use a heal, but I don't have any heals. I'm used to playing a and A rogue, you have nothing but food and bandages to get yourself back. Or healing potions, if you want to waste those. See, okay, there's one of these drony guys. Now these things I didn't know it at the time, but they're repairing these machine things over here, which they can also be mobs. Okay, I've accidentally aggroed something behind me, and he shot me with a saw blade. Wasn't that cool? It's like a flying buzzsaw. I got some kind of poison. Now when I respawn, I did not notice this thing that he repaired is attacking me. It's like a big demon ram snake head thingy is spitting dream gunk at me check that out I hear him looting this thing and another saw blade to the face now check out this thing that's a big fell reaver I was just walking along and I saw this giant ass demon machine monster I don't know what it is but I'm stalking it trying to catch up with it but it's so huge its steps are like miles apart so I can't keep up with it there's one of those demon pigs which I apparently have aggroed or it, made, it smelled me oh here it comes demon pig demon pig holy shit it's biting me it's biting me vanish the win oh look at that there's a dreadlord type thing. I never got around to attacking that. I need to attack one of those. Those are fun. They can cripple you and make you go really slow. Alright, here's the front of this thing. I managed to get on my mount. which has got like a black war tiger epic mount. And I got around to the front of it. We'll see what level it is. I can't even see the level on it. It's like a skull. It must be level 70. He's doing like 2800 damage for hit. 2876. Took about two good hits, but he was kind of slow. Now here it seems like the edge of the world, and there's another one of those big fell reaver things. I wanted to see, like, if there's water down there. I clicked on the map, and there's like some star islands or something, and it looked like there was water. But apparently there's nothing below. 